bit short on space, have you ever considered a hermit crab? They're compact, they're cute, and I'm told they're very addictive. crustacean family and it actually lives on land and likes to migrate to the water as well and um, it can't live solely underwater but it does enjoy having a bathe. Nice. Now you call it a crab obsession not me. Is it an obsession? It is. Um, we do say be careful. Warning crabs are addictive. When I moved into a one bedroom flat I looked at my choices for pets and I was just I just fell in love with them. As soon as I put one on my palm, I just fell in love with them. You are so beautiful. You need to find seashells for the hermit crabs that are properly fitting. This hermit crab on the right, it doesn't fit inside its shell properly. This crab is in danger of being attacked. With this crab, it's in a shell that is properly fitting. The big chelliped and the legs create a door so that the other hermit crabs cannot pull it out of its shell. Now, why does a man like you keep hermit crabs? I'm a bit lonely, so I needed something a bit special in my life. So, yeah, I started with um, one crab, one plastic tank, and that was it. And over the past four or five years, I've grown into what you've seen inside. Have you ever seen painted shells? Yeah. Yeah, that's kind of no, fun, isn't I it? I don't like them. Don't you? No. Why? I, I had thoughts of one day maybe painting some in some nestling colours, but that was about as far as I got, and I left it at that. I love you just the way you are. Kids, I'll let you in on a little secret. When I was your age, I would have told my brother to have one of these little guys. But remember that you're their only source of life. If you fail them, then they're just gone. So remember, Heat the tank from underneath, keep it at about 24 degrees, and make sure it's nice and humid in there. See, if it's not humid, they can't breathe. It's really, really important. And finally, don't pull them out of their shells. If you do, you won't have a hermit crab for very long. It's quite a constant maintenance, isn't it? We need to feed them every day, fresh yes, fruits yes. and veggies, uh, as well as their pellet diet, and then salt water and fresh water every day. So you need shells, at least two for each crab, three water bowls, a salt water one for bathing, fresh water for drinking and a food bowl, some crab food, salt and the water conditioner. You hope that lasts a long time, so if, you, if you can get the conditions right. It's um, a long term commitment. Yeah, long -term, yeah, yeah, wow. yeah, it is long term commitment. Mm. Yeah, a bit like marriage or something. <laughs> Buying a hermit crab is like It's a long term commitment. <laughs> What did you think about the hermit crabs? They're pretty good, aren't they? If you would like to know more about them, maybe so that you can get one or more yourself, get the July edition of the Burke's Backyard magazine.